They're the national champs. Two-time defending ACC champs. What stands between the Tigers and an ACC three-peat? Their first ACC game in 2017, it'll be a huge test. At Louisville, the 2016 game was a classic. Jackson flips it short, quick, works free, fights, spins out of bounds, did not get there. This fall, Louisville has Lamar Jackson back, while Clemson won't have Deshaun Watson. The next big date, September 30th, an ACC title game rematch against Virginia Tech, but this time, it's in Blacksburg. The Tigers will be running down the hill October 28th to take on Georgia Tech. Oh, hey, look, Clemson gets a bye the week before. Extra time for that defense to prepare for the Yellow Jackets option attack. The big one, November 11th, at home against Florida State. These two teams have ruled the ACC the last six years. It wouldn't surprise anyone if the winner of this game is not only the Atlantic Division winner, but also in position to be in the college football playoff. The Tigers start with two non-conference games that were already on the calendar, Kent State, then Auburn. Auburn could be a top 10 matchup. Remember, Davo Sweeney will be relying on a new QB after six years of Taj Boyd and Deshaun Watson. In October, Clemson is at Syracuse on Friday the 13th. Uh-oh, Georgia Tech, NC State, Florida State. That's a tough way to finish the ACC schedule. Will the Tigers be in the hunt for the college football playoff when they finish up with the Citadel in South Carolina? I'm Jeff Fischel, this is the ACC Digital Network.